fix the tire on the front today. So there has been work going on. These things have been ground smooth and they are welding uh, metal bars in there. Looks like that weld cracked. Maybe. Yeah, we're still trying to learn how to use this thing. How to get a good uh, method. Because it's not the prettiest welds. But they should work. And uh, the idea is take the other part and they're cut at 45 degrees so that it would come across and then go up. And there's these little metal rods to hold up a tray. And uh, you put sticks and other things in this end and light them on fire. And then the heat will rise up the chimney, pulling in more air in this side. And it creates like a draft that would cause fire to go through and up. And then there will be a little uh, pot holder on the top of it. So you would put your cooking vessel on top and it would be a stove. So that's what this is going to be once it's done. It's quite heavy for backpacking though. But um, anyway, we did that. Oh yeah, I can show you my spools. We fixed Tim's tire. It was missing... No, I had that one. It was missing the uh, little... A little round piece of metal in there. So the tire wasn't quite tight. It could wobble back and forth. But uh, fixed that, took the rim off, put the thing back, put it back together. And it's good now. Oh, I put a GoPro sticker on my bike. Uh, got that at a bike night yesterday. We got some spools here. And that's used for lifting the back end. It's already been used once. But there's a lift and you can lift up the back end for cleaning or lubing your chain, changing the back tire, whatever. It just makes it easier to hold the back end up. We have a finished airplane. Wings, the wheel pants, which are painted, so they're not white. <laughs>